The second half opens with Texas State holding a 21-10 lead over SFA. Very first play of the third quarter, the Bobcats again stuff the Lumberjack running game, this time courtesy of Joplo Bartu. The Bobcat ground game, however, had little trouble getting things going here. Marcus Curry slices through the Stephen F. Austin defense for 33 yards. After the two teams trade punts, the Bobcats have the ball back, still leading by a score of 21-10, but that would change in a hurry. Rutherford connects with Chase Harper, who somehow is left uncovered and free to gallop 71 yards untouched to the end zone to give the Bobcats a 28-10 lead late in the third quarter. The Jacks, Graylin Crawford returns the ensuing kickoff back for a touchdown, and the lead is back down to 11, 28-17. Curry adds eight more yards to his team-high total of 128, which was more than double that of the entire Lumberjack team, held to 66 yards by the Bobcat defense, which also got to the quarterback, Brady Attaway, who was sacked by Jordan Norfleet for a loss of eight. To the fourth quarter, and the score is still 28-17. Attaway's pass for Roberson to the end zone is picked off by Mager, giving the ball back to Texas State. After a three and out, the Bobcats punt the ball back to SFA, and no big return this time as Mike Brooks is wrapped up immediately by a gang of Bobcats. The Lumberjacks get a field goal to cut the lead to 28-20. And even though Curry reels off a nice eight-yard run, SFA's Josh Aubrey picks off a pass three plays later and scores on the return. The two-point conversion fails and it's now 28-26. Curry back to work and like a rocket takes off and picks up 37 yards to the SFA 33. Two plays later, Sean Rutherford connects with an open Alvo Garcia for 11 yards, his first catch of the game. And on the next play, it's Rutherford who darts through the defense, gets a big downfield block from Curry and picks up his first rushing touchdown as a Bobcat to put the Lumberjacks away with just over two minutes left to play. Any last miracle comeback for SFA is thwarted by the Bobcat defense, which surrendered just one offensive touchdown the entire game, and the Bobcats earned their fourth straight win at Homer Bryce Stadium with a 35-26 win over the Lumberjacks, evening their season record to 2-2.